This is the Narbox 2.0 SSD, an all-in-one compact and rugged solution that'll allow you to back up your photo and video content while you're on location without having to bring along a laptop or a computer to do so. So let's take a closer look. So yes, you don't need to use a computer with the Narbox 2.0 because, well, essentially it is a mini computer. Ultimately, it's a computer with a very slick operating system coupled with a fast and reliable solid state drive that comes in three sizes. On the front, there's a small screen and some physical buttons for navigating around that menu. In terms of connectivity, there's a built-in SD card slot, so you can just simply pop your storage card directly from your camera into the NAR box. We've got two USB-C ports for charging, connecting to a computer, attaching additional storage drives to increase the capacity, and for using adapters for those cameras that don't record to SD cards. And finally, a micro HDMI output so we can actually preview our content on an external monitor. On the back, there's a removable and rechargeable battery to power the device, and depending on the use, it should last between three and six hours per charge. And all of this, of course, is housed in that rather hardy gasket sealed aluminium and rubber enclosure that's really designed to be able to withstand the elements. So its most basic function is, of course, to allow you to back up your content while you're on location. And to do so very, very quickly, all you need to do is insert your SD card into the SD card slot, or of course, use the adapter if you're not using the SD cards. And then when the device is turned on, you simply press the one touch button to do that instant backup, and the transfer will begin. You've also got the option of performing a checksum verification to make sure that everything has been copied across exactly as it is on the original storage device. A nice feature to offer you some peace of mind. The easiest way to manage our saved content is to use the SaveKeep app on a smartphone. You simply download it, connect it to the Wi-Fi access point of the NAR box, and we can access all of the settings, control, and content from the phone or tablet. And here we can see my backed up card from my Lumix camera. This system will transfer any and all file types, but it does also recognize the most commonly used video and photo formats, so that you can actually load that content on your phone and preview it. If you have an external monitor, either on location or even a TV back at the hotel or in your house, you can also view content externally using that HDMI output. Within this app, you can also make H.264 proxies or even convert your footage to ProRes. There's also integration with Frame.io and Dropbox, so you can actually upload your footage whilst you're out in the field to remote collaborators for immediate access. Now, there's also an additional app called Selects available for Narbox. This application is more photo orientated, giving an easy way for photographers to quickly cull their images, add star ratings and keywords as metadata, again, all without needing a laptop. You can also export the raw photos directly from the NAR box to your smart device, so you can instantly edit those pictures in the likes of Lightroom or Affinity Photo. And of course, when you eventually get back to your workstation or the laptop that you have somewhere that you do your edits on, you can still mount the NAR box to your computer via USB-C and it will show up just like any other external drive. So it's not only your all-in-one backup solution out on location, but when you do eventually get back to your workstation, you can actually use this as your media drive to edit directly from. So I hope you found this video useful, guys. If you've got any questions, do just put them in the comments below and I will get back to you. And if you want to find out some more information on the NAR box, just head over to the Holden website. Thank you very much for watching.